Hey there, iPod Apps Weekly here, and I just want to show you um, this program that I wrote this morning. Uh, it's in, it's coded in Python, uh, Python 3.2 to be exact. And what it is is it's a Fibonacci program. If and if if you haven't heard about the Fibonacci sequence, it's basically like um, it's a sequence where you, if you add the last two numbers, the third number in the sequence will be the the sum of the first and second numbers. So like it's going to be zero, one, one, two. Uh, three, five, eight, you know all that. So I made a program that calculates that, and um, you can put in commands to find and list list the sequence to as many values as you want. Although if you list anything over fifty thousand or maybe five hundred thousand, it might take longer than a few minutes. So um, I just wanted to show you show it to you guys the power of Python, I guess, um, the power of reiteration in this case. Um, there are actually three while loops with two try and accept. Uh, try an exception uh, pairs. Um, why don't I just run it and show you how it works? Okay, so I'll close that and run it. Okay, so here's the program itself. It says, Hi, welcome to the Fibonacci sequence analyzer. Blah blah. blah. List commands. Let's find. Okay. Okay. So um, you have two commands in this. You can list and find. You can list basically list um, an entire the entire sequence to how many, like if you want to say list 10, then it lists 10 digits of the Fibonacci sequence. So I'm just going to do that for you now. List, then you type in how much, 10, and you'll get 10 numbers from the Fibonacci sequence, 0, 1, 1, 2, 3, 5, 8, blah, 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 blah. And to the right, as you can see, is an interesting correlation that I just found out. Um, I was just playing around with it, but like, um, if you see, if you divide the f first number by the, the number preceding it, then you'll get something very interesting as I use. not now because one if you divide by one by, one by zero is undefined but if you go keep on going on um, you'll see that the numbers get closer and closer to each other um, specifically 1.6 something something uh, around 1.6 as you can see I'll show that to you later but um, let's run it again I have to close it and run it again let's run it with the find so let's say I want to find the oops what the hell find there we go. Sorry about that. I don't know what happened there. Okay, uh, find and uh, let's find the sixth, sixtieth value. And it prints out the sixtieth value, which is rather a large number. Is it one? It's like it's even. It's in the tri It's way past the trillions. I don't even. Uh, sextillions. One of those. Yeah. But um, yeah. So that's basically my program. It's very very. Uh, I really really like. How, how it came out, and I just wanted to show, show it to you guys. Uh, the phone's ringing. Blah, 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 I'm gonna ignore that. Okay, so uh, I want to show you the 1.6 thing earlier. So let's say we list, let's list 100, 100 numbers from the Fibonacci sequence. And as you can see, something very interesting here happens. Um, the numbers start at one, then go to two, and then 1.5. See, two divided by one is two. Three divided by two is 1.5. Five divided by three is 1.6. So, so if if you didn't get it before, oh yeah, in the Fibonacci sequence. See, zero plus one is one. One plus one is two. Blah blah blah. Three, five. I think I explained this already, but I just wanted to make it clear. So, as you can see, if you keep dividing the preceding number by, I mean the the number by the number preceding it in the sequence, you'll get a number that is getting closer and closer to 1.618 um, 033 that's sort of the basic number that's what they call the golden ratio I believe 1.618 uh, someone google that for me actually let me I can just google it up right now golden ratio 1.618 according to Google Calculator and um, if you go on Wikipedia I don't know if it's the most trustworthy source although it does have these hilarious pictures of random people at the top now, um, the golden ratio is found in the Fibonacci sequence. Fibonacci. There we go. Fibonacci sequence. So, uh, this is very interesting stuff. It's it's cool if, if you're into math or into, like, anything. you'll actually find a lot of Fibonacci sequences um, associated with nature and stuff like that. So, I just found this stuff very interesting. Um, it's good to see, like, mathematics in freaking flowers and stuff, you know? That's kind of weird, but... Uh, but I just want to show you guys this program, and uh, if you guys ever want a copy of it, I'm happy to send it out to you guys as long as you, uh, I guess, give credit without like selling it or anything, because that would be um, illegal, right? Right. Okay. So, uh, anyways, um, yeah. So that's this is my Python three program that calculates and analyzes the Fibonacci sequence. Thank you so much, and have a good one.